Okay guys, so um, I'm gonna show you the new editor and give you some tips about it. So you go to mod, create layout, and we're gonna use the new editor. So here it is. So you use your mouse to look around. Uh, if you have a French keyboard like me, you have to swap to English keyboard, that's maybe easier. So first thing, you click and then you touch your mouse wheel and then you can go faster. So you have all the hotkeys um, here. So sorry for the mic quality, but you can get um, the hotkeys uh, in the official documentation, so if you have two screens, I suggest you to display the hotkeys uh, from the official documentation on another screen. I'm gonna leave a link in the description. So this is all you can do. So, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna do a simple track. So we click here, we made A like add, another A, and then I use space to turn like this. Okay, space, A, space, A, 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 I'm gonna zoom back, okay, like this, A, A, okay, like this. That's simple. Another turn here. Okay, another turn. And maybe we're gonna shift a few over here. A, A. Then we're gonna move maybe this way. Like this. Like this. Yeah. Very good. And when we return to the main point, uh, we try to get very close to it. And then we press C, and C it will close uh, the route. So now we can already try our race. So there's not much to say about. So it's very flat, so we are gonna try to... to change and to have more challenge. Okay. Uh, now we're gonna add some funny stuff. So first is uh, tilt. Uh, tilt is about. You see, I don't know if you've seen tilting the road. So we can take a point. We press the T button and we tilt. So it's not in the. Um, okay. Uh, when you have tilt like this. It's very important that you uh, add maglock. So for this, you click on the track, and press the M button, and if you click another point, you will see the point is purple. So it means it will have um, maglock. Um, very important, the maglock, uh, the maglock will not stay when we export in Unity. I'm gonna show you just a little bit here. You see Maglock. Otherwise the, way, the ship will fall down. Okay. 
next thing we can make, um, we can change the height. So for this, we pressed Shift and Space, and we can change the height. For example, here we're gonna add some height, and here maybe we'll go a little bit. Here we're gonna add some eights. So it's more 3D. Okay, next thing I'm gonna add is a jump. So we press, I think this one. Yeah, and we press the G, the J, button. like jump. Okay. Uh, next thing we're gonna do. Uh, here uh, we're gonna press the uh, Q button and we're gonna enlarge a bit here and we're gonna do the same for the right and we're gonna enlarge a bit here uh, there's lots of stuff you can do like you can remove the borders like this and so that's it for now, you, you can make lots of things, you can add new route, you can add a pit lane, but for now we're gonna keep it simple. So now that we have our track, we'll save it. Uh, I'm gonna name it tutorial. I save it. So this is the, um, the file for um, uh, it's proper to Ballistic NG. Uh, then we can export it to an obg file So that can be useful for um, if You want to open it in blender for example and most important we're gonna export it to TRM And this is the file we're gonna use in Unity So that's it for the layout creator as you see it's very simple, but just think to display um, the shortcut it's very hard to get the shortcut to remember the shortcut so you you have to get used to it and after that you can do a lot of things so we'll see in unity how to get the track into unity and add something thank you